We're taking action for a pastor who says he forked over thousands of dollars to get the parking lot of his church paved only to be left with rubble. It's a story we first brought to you yesterday and today 7 Action News reporter Amira David is in Troy getting results. Well, as you can see, the caution tape is up and that's because this is a construction zone. Yet again, we're told this equipment was back on the lot just an hour after our story aired. What they're doing now is uh, getting ready for the first coat, uh, what they call the rough coat. Pastor Dennis Wegner of Troy Church of Nazarene getting a look at something he says he hasn't seen in several months. Contractors picking up on a project he says he was told would be finished several months ago. I was frustrated by the fact that it's the church's money and uh, people work hard and um, I just felt that we needed some help. Last October, the pastor forked over $8,000 to Hamilton Asphalt and Concrete to replace a portion of the church parking lot. We have paid him a little over half his money and now I can't even contact him by telephone. Wagner says several phone calls went unanswered. We tried to talk to the contractor about the holdup today, but he declined an on-camera interview, telling us it was all just a big misunderstanding. He says there were some delays initially due to weather and later due to scheduling. But the good news, the contractor is here today, leaving this pastor with restored faith that the job will get done. I want to thank Channel 7 for coming out so quickly, uh, coming back uh, when I sent a text this morning that they were working and uh, you help do things that I couldn't do. And the contractor tells me that he expects to be finished with the entire project by Monday. Of course, we're going to stay on top of it to make sure that it gets done. For now, reporting in Troy, Amira David, 7 Action News.